5.30, a Clinton Township firefighter responds to a medical run at a house and sees a family of seven in need. The Stones have been struggling lately and falling back on some bills. That's when a complete stranger came to the rescue in more ways than one. 7 Action News reporter Anu Prakash has the story. Ryan McEwen is a Clinton Township firefighter who also runs his own business. When he saw a family in need, he wasted no time using his own money to help them out. Oh yeah, we've been going through a lot. Christy Stone knows what it's like to struggle. She and her husband have five kids. The youngest two, Tyler and Troy, both have muscular dystrophy. Troy must stay on a ventilator and was recently hospitalized. With him being in the hospital and stuff, and my husband was working and they garnished his wages and had to get off work early, so come pick me up. They go visit him for seven weeks, so we got behind on a lot of stuff. And that included the power bill. A couple of weeks ago, while Troy was back at home, the power was cut off. Stone had to call 911. Even though she has batteries for the ventilator, they don't last long. The batteries only last a few hours on both of them. So. Clinton Township firefighters responded. Firefighter Ryan McEwen started talking to Stone and found out the power had been shut off because the family had a $1,000 bill that needed to be paid. Hearing that was all it took. Like to take care of it. Took a picture of her bill, uh, and then uh, so we had you know we took him to the hospital. We had to just to get him set up, and then uh, so I just called DTE. My first reaction was to give him a hug, and say thank you. And soon the power was back on. It got Troy home because he couldn't come home without power. So yeah, it meant. A lot, uh, so much. <laughs> a few days later, Stone stopped by the fire department with a card and cookies for McEwen. And we were there today as he stopped by for another hug and to give Clinton Township Fire Department t shirts to Tyler and Troy. McEwen says deciding to pay that bill was a no brainer. You just have to see what we saw. And it's just, this is, it's, you have to want to help this, right? Stone says Troy is a huge fan of the Red Wings and Lions. He's met many of them. And now this 18 year old has another hero to look up to. We can make it a little bit better. Come here. Come here. That's all we're trying to do. McEwen says he hopes this story will inspire all of us to do what we can to help others. As for the Stones, they are trying to raise money for a generator. If you would like to help out, we have the information on our website, WXYZ.com. A new Prakash, 7 Action News. So touching to see and not surprising to us here at Action News because that is the brother of a young woman, Ashley, who worked here many years doing behind the scenes work and it's just an all around great family. Hats off, Ryan. Yeah, great job. Yeah.